The National Science Foundation celebrates the achievements, success, passion, and scientific breakthroughs of African Americans across the globe. This is Black History Month. Sometimes just becoming aware of one's own biases and owning them is actually gets us a, 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 you know, a long way down the road. I always tell my students, I'm like, you have to choose either your commitment to believing that you're non-biased or actually becoming non-biased. <laughs> but you can't have both, <laughs> right? You really have to be honest with yourself where you are on a range of group identities and issues and in order to assess where you are, right? If you're really so rigidly committed to I'm not bad, I'm not prejudiced, I'm, I'm liberal, I'm this, I'm a mm -hmm. good person, <laughs> right, uh -huh. which is what we default to, then you're not gonna make any progress, right? I mean, you know, everyone, most of us, our, our grandparents are also good people. And for most of us, they have some ideas that we would sure. not really want to identify sure. with. Sure. Sometimes we call them bigoted, yeah. <laughs> right? Turns out you can be a good person and a bigot at the same time, huh. or at least have those ideas. So I mean, it's, it's taking something out of the, the realm of a, like a subconscious bias into a conscious choice? Or at least a conscious awareness of it that makes you slow down, right? It makes you rethink what might have been your automatic decision.